So welcome for math lesson. Uh, the topic is still probability and I would like us to, to check something called probability space. So probability space is a, a list of all possible outcomes, whether variable or not variable. Or in other terms, when we talk of probability space, we just mean that a list of all Another name of uh, the probability space. Or the probability or sample space. Sample space, possibility space, or what we call probability space, is a list of all possible outcomes of any given event. Let's say, for example, uh, two coins are tossed. Two coins, two coins uh, tossed. When two coins are tossed, remember a coin has a head or a tail and the other one too. Therefore, we can say that uh, the probability space can be outlined as shown below. We can have for the first coin, we can have a head. We can have a head and a tail. And the other one too, we can have a head and a tail. So the outcomes now can be listed as the outcomes can be listed as in the first trial, it is possible we have a head and a head from the other coin. So we will have a and a from the other coin. We can also have a and a tail. It is possible to have a tail and a head, tail and a head, or a tail and a tail, tail and a tail. So these are what we call possible outcomes. And this list of possible outcomes is what we are terming as a probability space or possibility space or sample space of a given event. So our probability space can be used to help us calculate some questions on probability, like the question I will just give out now, which says that uh, two dies, so the question says that two dies, two dies, dies is the plural of a die, are tossed together. Are tossed together. Then we are told what is the probability? What is the probability? The sum of the two upper figures, the sum of the two upper phases will be part A 7 and part B 9 so let's check A what this question requires it is good to know that a, a die is numbered or labeled 1 up to 6. Therefore, the first die has labels 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So what we can see from the first die is either 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. That is what can appear 
each at a time. Then we have the second die because we are told two dice. The second die has also one. It has a two. It has a three. It has a four. Five and finally six. Then now, according to this question, we are told that uh, we should find that the probability that the sum of two upper phases will be a seven. This means when the two phases are tossed together, then the phases which show up, the value in them gets added. And so we can say, if we get one and one, then we add them, we will get a two. So let me fill now the spaces. So it is possible to get a sum of two when we add one and one. When we have one and two, we get three. When we have one and three, we we'll get four. One and four, five, six, or seven. We can also have two and one, and that will give us three, the sum. Two and two, four. Two and three, five, six, seven, eight. Here we will have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Four one will give us five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then five and one we get six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Here we will have uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So these are the possible outcomes. These are the possible outcomes from a certain event whereby two dice have been thrown at once. Then after getting what is on the face, we had up. These are the possible outcomes. So we want to find the probability that the sum of the phases will give us a 7. We check the areas where we have 7 and we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we have part A, the probability of getting a 7. We have 6 out of 36 possible outcomes this will give us a sixth as the simplified probability so probability that we will have a seven on top or we will have a seven as the hardened values of what is obtained on the face is a sixth then part b the probability that it will be a nine will be we have one, two, three, four. Four options out of 36 trials or 36 possible outcomes. And this will give us one out of nine. So that is how we use probability space to calculate probability of uh, required outcomes.